What's going on, fellas? It's your boy B with the beard, your beer connoisseur. And today on this episode, we're going to talk about beard knots. That's right, these knots that you get at the end of your beard and it starts to knot up and you're trying to figure out how the heck to get rid of them and how the heck did they get there. It's like you woke up somebody who was tying your hair in your sleep. Anyhow, we all experience this. I've experienced this. I experienced this. Now, the, uh, the scientific term, the technical term is trichonodosis. Okay, that's the technical term. Hence, what it is is just layman's term is beer knots. All right. Now, how where it comes from is due to the fact that um, when it when our water the water molecule, our hair compound, and as well as the uh, protein uh, 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 molecule molecule uh, in our hair, what happens is that it's it's lowered. Okay, it's lowered. They have like a relationship and the relationship with our our hair strands because our hair strand uh, is asymmetrical. Our hair follicle is asymmetrical and our hair strand is flat. OK, it's flat. It's not oval, uh, but it's flat. Uh, and so as well as it coils up, it curls up. OK, so with that, our um Hair shaft that's on the hair strand is irregular, so that mixture with the water and the protein, um, the uh, in our in the irregular hair shaft reduces um, our ability reduces uh, the protein as well as the water. Thus, um, what you find is that now you you have what they call um, knots knots in your hair. That's that's the science part of it. You know, if it makes sense, it may or may not make sense to you. However, that's just the science part of it, all right? You get hair knots. Now, this happens in our sleep. It happens when uh, throughout the day it can happen. And what typically happens is that your the hair knots, what they begin to do is because they are coiling, sometimes or a lot of times they begin to... Um, mesh with other hairs that's right next to it thus once they start the mesh then they begin to because it's coily and it's curly already they begin to form, form a knot as if you know as if somebody came there and tied ties you up got you real tight so that's enough that's that's one way or you can have just a knot on a single strand as well you can have a knot on a single strand but again, because of our coarse and kinky hair, um, it's uh, you're gonna find that it happens. That's just the way our our hair structure. Um, that's the way our hair structure is. Now, what you can do about it, all right? There's some things you can do about it. Is one, you want to make sure uh, keep your beard moisturized. I can't say this enough. You have to keep your beard moisturized it's very very important um, another thing you can do is you can take some um, do a uh, a deep intense uh, beard conditioner or you can do the Hulk all right and that's the beard that's the avocado beard mask and I'm going to actually I got some other stuff that's coming down the pipeline to add to that that's gonna take it to a whole nother level that's gonna give it the intensity um, you can find on the video, on the YouTube YouTube video I've done uh, already, go check the catalog. I've done a, a deep conditioner, beard conditioner. Now we're going to step it up where we're going to do a deep, intense uh, beard conditioner um, or beard mask. So that's going to be for another video. Uh, back to these knots. And fellas, you guys have have asked like how, what do we do how do we get rid of them like i was saying one you want to moisturize so you want to do a deep beard conditioner deep intense beard condition uh, 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 uh conditioner um as well as you want to take some oil and you know you can just take some oil and then you know at night use the oil and make sure you just get your ends okay make sure you you put the oil on your ends all right 
another 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 thing you can do is you can grab you a wide tooth beer comb wooden okay you can find this on blackmansgreenden.com this is the new the new 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 we just got this in um matter of fact you may not even find it up there yet because like i said we just got this in like yesterday all right so this is a new it's wide wide tooth uh wooden pick i love this i really really do i do i do i do um this is going to help with the detangle but also more importantly than that you can use use your fingers use your fingers to help um uh, if you're you know spreading the oil or if you're using balm or butter or a um a, 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 a leave-in conditioner use your fingers to move it around that's going to help as well also when you go to sleep at night all right number four when you go when you go to, i think that's four or five but when you're sleeping at night you want to get you a silk or satin pillowcase because you're turning you're tossing it around and again when you're tossing and turning around in your sleep what's happening you mashing up against your beard then of course your beard begins to dance and then begins to turn then it begins to what and it gets tangled up it starts to knot up like a bow and there you go you wake up now you got knots all right but that's why you want to get a silk or satin pillowcase because the silk and satin or the pillowcase, what that's going to do is A, it's going to help keep your beard moisturized throughout the night. And then um, B, you're going to be able to wake up without it being all matted and all um, uh, 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 dry, uh, 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 you know, and, and, and things of that nature. So um, that's why got a beard here. It happens. It's, my beard is getting longer. Um, as you can tell, see, all oh, that, that's new growth right there. Yep, that's new growth, all oh, right there. As you can tell, you can see that. Yeah, man. Anyhow, back to business. So, that's what you want to do at night. Get you one of those, because you can't wrap your beard up, or you're going to suffocate yourself, and that's not what we're here to do. We're not here to go out like that. So, get you, get you a pillowcase, satin, and silk. All right, and that's gonna help keep your beard moisturized as well as gonna help it keep it from matting up and matting up and entangling and, 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 and forming knots and things. Like, these are the things you can do to help reduce the knots. All right, but understand that due to our structure of our hair, it does happen, it will happen, but you can begin to do things to reduce the probability of it happening, and it's very important to have a great beard routine. It's highly important to have a great beard routine to counteract that, okay? You gotta have a great beard routine. You gotta keep your beard moisturized at all times. And because of the fact that we have a challenging time to keep our beard moisturized, we have to be on it all the time. Ain't, there is no day off. There is no time to rest. Um, you have to stay on it, keep it healthy, um, keep it uh, moisturized, get you rather fine, get product that's going to help seal the moisture in, fine product that's going to help moisturize the product, uh, uh, moisturize your, your, your beard and the skin underneath your beard. But most importantly, if you don't do this, all the applications, all those type of products you're applying on your beard will be null and void. Because you have to drink water. I recommend drink at least a gallon of water. You have to hydrate yourself. You have to hydrate your, your, your skin. You have to hydrate your, your body. Thus, when you hydrate, when your skin and your body is hydrated, your beard is going to be hydrated. And then you are, you are able to use applications. These app, application products um, is going to help heighten, enhance um, what you're already putting into your body, that's what they're used for to enhance what you're already putting in your body. It's not the opposite. Okay. It's not beard products are not there to, as a way to cheat your way to a healthy beard. No, it doesn't work like that. It just doesn't. You have to put the groundwork in and that's making sure you're eating the right things, making sure you keep it hydrated. But I didn't want to get off on a tangent. This is all about beard knots. And 
uh, how to minimize, how to reduce these beer knots. So if you do those things, again, I'm going to say it one last time. You want to moisturize, number one. Get you a, uh, do, a do the uh, avocado deep conditioner mask, okay? Um, also, um, get a, um, a wooden wide tooth beer cone or wide tooth pick. One of these here, okay? And also, rub your, use your, your fingers to rub the products into your beard, okay? And then also, you want to get some, you know, when you're applying beard oil or, you know, when you're applying a leave-in conditioner, you want to also begin to um, focus on your ends. You know, get it in your beard, but focus on your ends. Use some oil, get some beard oil, and begin to focus on your ends. Get some beard oil, focus on your ends. Focus on sealing your ends, sealing your ends, because that's where you're going to find the knots. You're going to find the knots at the ends here. Majority of the time, you find the knots at the end of your beard, Okay. Oh, one last thing. I'm not forgetting something. This is what you don't want to do, okay? If you see the knot, don't pull it. Because then now, you don't pull the, your hair growth. So, get you some shears, okay? Go to the beauty supply store, all right? And what you want to do, if you got a knot here, let me get close. If you got a knot right here, if the knot's there, then clip it, trim it. Okay, that's how you're going to manage it. Trim it. Don't pull the hair out. Don't, you know, cut it. No, trim it. Just wherever the knots are, trim it. Okay, wherever the knots are, trim it. All right? And then, another thing you want to do, get a silk satin pillowcase. All right? So, that's what? Moisturize. Uh, do the uh, the deep, the avocado mask, uh, conditioner, deep conditioner. Um, you want to, uh, use, get the oil, seal it with some oil. Um, uh, also you want to, um, what else I say? Uh, oil and a silk satin pillowcase. All right. You want to do that. And I'm trying to think, what else did I say? Um, shoot. I think that's it. Watch the video. And if I missed anything, I've said it. I already said it. You guys can watch the video. I don't have to repeat myself. All right. Uh, listen, fellas, thank you. Appreciate it. That's how you're going to get rid of That's how you're going to reduce those, those beer knots. All right. You got to have a good beer routine. Okay. Um, also, subscribe, at the, subscribe, tell a friend and tell a friend. Also, get in on the newsletter. Subscribe. I got a link down at the bottom. You can get to the newsletter. Get to the newsletter. Sign up. Um, you know, we're giving away free product, a uh, free, you know, give it away some wooden combs, wide tooth, uh, conditioners, bombs, uh, a, a host of things. But if you're not subscribing to the newsletter, you're not going to get, uh, you're not going to have a chance, an opportunity to win. So give yourself a chance to win. Hit the link at the bottom. Um, to get on the newsletter, you know, you know, and that way you'll be able to enter in to win prizes, giveaways that we'll be doing um, throughout the year, as well as you'll get you'll you'll be able to uh, uh, learn about new products coming down the pipeline. So you'll be the first to know. All right. Um, also, uh, one another thing I want to I want to I want to add too. I want to add this. Um, if you guys have anything that I have not covered, you want me to cover, put it in the comments, all right? If there's anything I have not covered, put it in the comments, okay? Um, like always, this your boy Be With The Beard, and I'm out.